Hey, what's up? Chris Trini here again for a very quick tip if you're using Wix. Today we're talking about Wix video, which has a ton of possibilities. I'm a filmmaker that shares my work online all the time. So these features were such a must for my platform, my website. So let's jump into Wix and let's see how to get that set up. Okay, so to add Wix video, first we have to go under add apps. And in here you can look for it, browse it, or you can search Wix video. So there we go, we can select it and we can just add this to the site. And this is just gonna load some placeholder content that we can change to whatever we like. And by the way, you only have to search for the app once because from this point on, you can go under add, then go to the middle here to video. Now Wix video allows you to upload your own content or add videos from YouTube or Facebook, as you can see here. And of course, all of this can be customized. You see some layouts here that could be a really nice and interesting way of presenting your visuals. Now in here, we can manage videos. So you can essentially say which videos to pick from and which videos to add. So here is my video library and this includes also a video that I've linked from YouTube. So I can select videos this way. I can go onto channels where I can essentially select playlists or ways that I've grouped my content in different ways and I can have that updated onto my video here. Now in here you can change settings, customize the way that this is laid out. You can also change the design to really make sure that it fits with the theme of your website. Now if we want to add a channel, which is a way of grouping things, we can just go under manage videos. And then by the side menu here, go under channels and we can go and create a new channel. Now in this page, you can actually add videos and you can select videos that you've uploaded or videos that you've linked uh, from YouTube, for example. So I can select just a couple. Now the nice thing is you can grab these and move them around and rearrange the order in which they will be displayed in. In the channel info, you can select edit and you can name this, you can add a description. You can even upload a custom thumbnail and then you can just click save. Now if we close this out and I go under settings here of this video strip, I can actually select that channel that we just created. And you can see that it updates with those videos. All right, I hope you learned something from this very quick tip and I will see you in the next one.